Pashtun nationalism Pashto, Peacetown MLT Pound is a political and social movement which promotes the idea that the Pashtuns are deserving of a sovereign nation in their homeland of Pashtunistan, which consists of the Pashtun majority parts of Afghanistan and Pakistan. Pashtun nationalism is closely linked to the cause of Pashtun home rule and Pashtun independence. In Afghanistan, Pashtun nationalists look after the interests of the Pashtun ethnic group and has its support only from them. They favor the ideas of a greater Afghanistan, i.e. it claims the Pashtun-speaking parts of Pakistan for Afghanistan. Therefore, the concept of Pashtun nationalism politically overlaps with Afghan nationalism. History One of the earliest Pashtun nationalists was the warrior poet, Bayezid Pir Roshan. Another early Pashtun nationalist was Kushal Khan Khatak, who was imprisoned by the Mughal emperor Aurangzeb for trying to incite the Pashtuns to rebel against the rule of the Mughals. However, despite sharing a common language and believing in a common ancestry, the Pashtuns first achieved unity in the 18th century after being under foreign rule for many centuries. The eastern parts of Pashtunistan was ruled by the Mughal Empire, while the western parts were ruled by the Persian Safavids as their easternmost provinces. During the early 18th century, Pashtun tribes led by Mirway Hotak successfully revolted against the Safavids in the city of Kandahar. In a chain of events, he declared Loy Kandahar and other parts of what is now southern Afghanistan independent. By 1738 the Mughal Empire had been crushingly defeated and their capital sacked and looted by forces of a new Iranian ruler, the military genius and commander Nader Shah. Besides Persian, Turkmen, and Caucasian forces, Nader was also accompanied by the young Ahmad Shah Durrani, and 4,000 well-trained Pashtun troops from what is now Afghanistan and northwest Pakistan. After the death of Nader Shah in 1747 and the disintegration of his massive empire, Ahmad Shah Durrani created his own large and powerful Durrani Empire, which included Pashtunistan, and most of nowadays Pakistan, among other regions. The famous couplet by Ahmad Shah Durrani describes the association the people have with the regional city of Kandahar. Da Dili Takht Z Haroma Che Rayad Kam, Zama Da Shkule Pashtunkwa Da Ghro Saruna. Translation. I forget the throne of Delhi when I recall, the mountain peaks of my beautiful Pashtunkwa. The last Afghan empire was established in 1747 and united all the different Pashtun tribes as well as many other ethnic groups. Parts of the Pashtunistan region around Peshawar was invaded by Ranjit Singh and his Sikh army in the early part of the 19th century, but a few years later they were defeated by the British Raj, the new powerful empire which reached the Pashtunistan region from the east. Famous Pashtun independence activists against the rule of the British Raj include Baka Khan, Abdul Samad Khan Achakzai, and Mirzali Khan Fakir of IPI. Baka Khan and his followers, the Kudai Kedmatgars, strongly opposed the All India Muslim League's demand for the partition of India. When the Indian National Congress declared its acceptance of the partition plan without consulting the Kudai Kedmatgar leaders, Baka Khan felt very sad and told the Congress, You have thrown us to the wolves. In June 1947, Baka Khan, Mirzali Khan, and the Kudai Kedmatgar movement declared the Banu Resolution, demanding that the Pashtuns be given a choice to have an independent state of Pashtunistan composing all Pashtun territories of British India, instead of being made to join Pakistan. However, the British Raj refused to comply with the demand of this resolution. After the creation of Pakistan in 1947, Mirzali Khan and his followers refused to recognize Pakistan and continued their guerrilla war against the new state's government from their base in Gurwak, Waziristan. Mirzali Khan also announced the creation of Pashtunistan as an independent nation. A Pashtun jirga, held in Razmak, Waziristan, appointed Mirzali Khan as the president of the National Assembly for Pashtunistan. Mirzali Khan didn't surrender to the government of Pakistan throughout his life. See also Pashtun Tahafuz movement Pashtunistan Durand Line Kudai Kedmatgar Baka Khan Abdul Samad Khan Achakzai Mirzali Khan Mullah Powinda Sartor Fakir Umra Khan 
Awami National Party Pashtunkhwa Mili Awami Party Afghan Malat Party Pashtun colonization of northern Afghanistan <laughs>